I'm seeing a woman here. She's disappointed. What is she? She's not here. It has broken your heart. This, 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 this. Eh? Yeah, because I'm seeing you crying. You're crying even now. Very disappointed. It's like betrayal and stuff that I'm seeing. <coughs> yeah. Stop crying. We hear our prisoners. God loves you. It's going to, do you still want your wife? Yes, sir. Yes. Are you sure? Sure, sure, sure? But you're giving up. Yeah? Yes. I'm still giving up. Your wife will come to your senses. What is it? Yes. Go, go, go. Let me pray for you. Okay, okay, Jesus. Jesus. You know, I'm praying for this man. <coughs> ah, the wife did something very great. The wife did something that. Uh, <coughs> and, uh, and God doesn't want this man to divorce. Uh, this man, God doesn't want <coughs> him to divorce. The wife did something very bad. And God said to me, I must pray for his wife so that there will be peace. And this man must forgive his wife. On what? You hear what I'm trying to say? Will you forgive? If you forgive, forget the past. Yes. Uh, you forget the past. Um, uh, you are blessed with him. My name is Moses Padre. I come from uh, Chavez Pepe West. Uh, I came to meet with the man of God first time today. I don't believe this. This is a miracle. I remember I saw the man of God on Facebook as I was going through the Facebook and I came across some of his videos and I decided from long ago that I want to come here and fellowship with the man of God. And last week I wanted to come but something happened. I couldn't and yeah today I woke up this morning I was supposed to go to my church but I told you know Mama Ruto, I can't know I won't be around and I decided to come here as I came in I just wanted to fellowship with the brethren I didn't know that I would meet the men of God one on one and today during the service I felt anointing you know as the men of God was teaching and I meet the men of God one on one and I bless the Lord for that. So the man of God just uh, spoke to me now. And I, I actually had, you know, two things that I wanted to tell the man of God, which is to prophesy, you know, upon my ministry, upon my finances. But when the man of God saw me, he just says, God loves me. And there's a lady that has disappointed me, that has broken my heart. And I confirm that that is my wife. And I'm speaking right now, me and my wife, we are separated. I'm staying in the other property and she remained in the other house. And yeah, the man of God has prophesied. I never thought, you know, there would be somebody that would speak upon my marriage because I was at the point where I just wanted to sign the divorce papers. Actually, I tried twice to sign those divorce papers, but here I am by the grace of God. And the man of God just said I should, you know, forgive her. And I'm more than willing to forgive and start afresh to come with the glory. Amen. So I want to encourage you, brethren, out there to say, there's still hope. There is God who never changes. He's the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. And I love him so much. Thank you.